Today, Kevin and I have a variety of candies to try for you. Uh, these are the Barrett Dolly Mix. This is the Around Trees Randoms. And I have the Warheads Wedgies. So the Warheads were a dollar at the Dollar General. So those were the American products. Both of these were out of the UK. The uh, Dolly Mix was two sixty nine. dollars The uh, Round Trees Randoms were three fifty nine. dollars So if you're in the UK, uh, you can tell us what your prices are. That was a pound. Uh, yeah, this was supposed to be a pound in Looks pound like land. Yeah. Uh, so the Dolly Mix, no artificial colors and flavors, sweet shop favorites, it says. Experience the tongue-twisting world of Barrett for over 170 years. We've been creating fun, wonder, and excitement. Um, it says they're multicolored candy and jelly sweets. Okay. Oh. Okay. <sighs> this smells mm, interesting. interesting. Okay, so you have uh, these, these, these. There's, There's a, a green, yellow one. Yellow one. Yellow one. There's a green. Green. No, I don't have. That, that's okay. You can have that dark green, and I have a slight green one. And there's this one that looks like sugar. Mm, that's the only one there is. Though. Okay. It's okay. I'll take a picture of what's left. You're not going to get to see everything oh, in the bag. Okay. okay. So what do you want to try first? We can try no, this yeah. one. Yeah. Oh, do you like being good there? Or not, it looks like a... Gumdrop. Gumdrop. Oh. Ooh, that's an interesting flavor. Mm-hmm. Is that maybe black currant? That's, uh, yeah. Tastes like black currant. Not bad. It's just got a little tart, a little tartness to it. It's very, very soft. It, I love the texture. The texture is just like a, a gumdrop here, except it's not as uh, dense. Kind of like a jelly baby almost. Yeah, our gumdrops are very They're dense, sticky. and this one's not. It's mm. it's like uh, fluffier and easier to chew. Mm -hmm. Okay, what about this one? The purple. Oh, there's a small pink one. Now, I love that texture. Mm. And that is an awesome texture. What, what color did we just eat? Purple. I couldn't tell you what it was supposed to taste like I have though. No clue what it's like. But I love that texture. I'm gonna I'm gonna love all these. Look, there's also these. Oh gosh, there's all kinds of stuff in here. Okay. Which might be the same thing as this. No. I bet it is. I don't know, it's hard to tell. And that tastes the same. Mm -hmm. The purple and the brown one taste exactly that the, same. Taste the same. I wonder if the pink one will. These are dangerous. I love the texture because they're like mm -hmm. um, sugar paste or something. Mm -hmm. It's almost like a mm. like marzipan's really gritty. Yeah. It's almost that way, but it's not as gritty as. I think I like fondant, but not but, as dry. Yeah. It, oh, that's perfect. Because fondant's kind of dry, but it's, it's no. You're of right. Of course, too. it is. It's it. Yes, that would. You're like, what's the texture? This is like a fondant texture. Hmm. Wow. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. It ends badly. It turns it starts, bad. It starts like really oh, nice long. Oh, oh. <laughs> that ends funky. Good <laughs> grief. It started off so nice like lime jello and then it, it went horribly, Immediately horribly changed. wrong. Where did they get that lime? I don't know. Did you try a brown one? I've tried all kinds over here. I know. Let's see. I, probably, I think I did try a brown one because it tastes just like the other ones. Mm. Did you want an orange one? I've had that one. So the orange. Oh, now the orange does taste different. I bet you the other ones were supposed to taste different and they're just not strong enough. Yeah, that's not orange though. No, I guess it's kind I of I think it is, yeah. yeah. The orange reminds me of a creamsicle orange. Yeah. I mm. actually really like the orange and can tell the difference, but now... I can't tell the difference between the pink and the purple ones. Uh -huh. I took one of these yellow, this yellow diamond and broke it. Look, it's got a white ah. filling. Those are nice. I like. Mm -hmm. I think. I think the texture gets me more than the flavor. Or me too. Oh yeah. The flavor's good. It's sweet. 
Now, but, hopefully you don't get a lot of those lime ones because I would never want one of those again. Yeah, it's but pretty strong. The texture of that, you could literally eat the entire bag in no time. If we had this sitting in there at the computer, we would eat all these mm -hmm. just because you, you want one after the other. Yes, and they're very, very sugar gritty. Mm -hmm. uh, like you said, it's like fondant. a it's like a fondant. That it's, yellow one was limited. It's too, terrific. Uh, these are the. It says new. I don't know how new they are. Round trees since 1881. Randoms, squidgy swirls, squidgy yogurty fruit chews. Um, billions of possible combinations all bursting with irresistible fruity flavors meaning you'll never get the same bag twice they have black currant and yogurt strawberry and yogurt and apple and yogurt I don't know that's millions of combinations but okay and it had a little cool thing mmm hmm hmm <laughs> <laughs> well yeah these are the mushy ones I like it's, these yeah, it's 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 it smells good, but it smells different. Okay, so you get three. I think so. Well, I guess they put different flavors different? in different bags. That's black yeah. currant yogurt is the dark one. Okay, the purple. Uh huh. Yeah, these are like a tough marshmallow. Mm. That tastes like a bean boozled flavor. What was it supposed to be? Black currant and yogurt. Yeah, I got both. You know what? It's not sweet. No, I don't mind the texture. It's kind of a, like I said, it's like a really tough marshmallow. It's like, it's a nice texture, but it is not sweet at no, all. It's I don't. Kind of funky. Yeah, it has a that black currant flavor, which is all right, uh, but it's it's just there's no sweetness there. Why would you eat that? No, no, no. Okay, the other pink one is strawberry and yogurt. The white one. I think the yogurt's the part that's ruining it. Yeah, because it's there's, it's like it's sucking all the sweetness out of yeah, it. Yeah, it's got an odd sour mm -hmm. bite to it. Yeah, I do not like the yogurt part. Yeah, that's probably why I smelled and it was like okay at first, and then it was yeah. like what is that? I think it's that yogurt that's part. The, yogurt. the next one is apple and yogurt. Because they all have that same funkiness. If you. I can take, the, I can get this whole yeah, bag over there. I'm just going to get a few of them all. Yeah, those are not, those are not ones I would buy. The best one's the apple. It is, but it's still not great. Mm -hmm. I would never buy those again. It, it still ends with a sour, kind of mm -hmm. funky, like you've had milk that's gone bad or something. Yeah. It's, it's not good. I could definitely eat all the green ones. I, I could, could eat all the apple ones because those actually have a smidgen uh sweet but they're still oh that's cute that's a kitty cat yeah, there's a snake. um but there's I, I would not buy that bag i think that's a waste of your money yeah, because really that good. yogurt flavor i really think we're in that whole bag now these are the american ones so you know they're gonna be strong as can be and they're warheads so warheads we, there's the bunny? there's uh, three flavors in here. These are called wedgies, which I, I is, the name is questionable. Okay, when you give somebody a wedgie, this ain't what you're thinking about. Yeah, you don't want a wedgie. You don't want a wedgie. Uh, pink lemonade, cherry limeade, and watermelon punch. Uncomfortably sour is what they're saying. They've got some cute little characters. I didn't even notice the characters on these. Look, like, see that thing. Like, it looks like a snowman. That's a snow. That is a snowman. So there's a bunny rabbit. Um, there's a snail. There's a pumpkin. There's a cat. A, a shell. A, I don't know what that is. Gosh, that smells good. <laughs> that smells really good. Don't mess my. I just got you all these figures out. Don't mess I know you did, honey, but I have to have place for these. I do. The sweetest experience you'll ever have with a wedgie. Fruity on the inside, uncomfortably sour on the outside. Wonder if that, the, the, so they na made them that name on purpose. Yeah. They knew what they were doing because they're uncomfortable. A wedgie would be very uncomfortable. They did that on purpose. Is there three flavors? Yes, pink lemonade, cherry limeade, and watermelon punch. Do you want to cut these in half? Uh, sure. I think if you cut them, yeah. Those are more manageable. Mm. 
Five pieces are 100 calories. I like those. They do have a little sourness to them, but it's not like painful sour. It's more of a more of a sour patch kid sour. Maybe a little bit sour than that, but all I'm tasting, it said watermelon punch. Really, all I'm getting is watermelon. I'm getting a little of the punch flavor. A little bit. Not as much as the watermelon. No, the watermelon's the, the watermelon strongest, strongest flavor. flavor. Yeah. Honestly, the punch adds a little bit of a funkiness to it. I would rather it all just be plain watermelon. Oh, I get that. The texture's terrific. Mm, it it's is a, a very soft gummy. Kind of. Yes, it's very, very soft. It's a soft jelly. Kind of like a, a, a gum drop, but softer. This is pink lemonade. Yeah, kind of like the inside of a jelly bean, but not as hard. Mm. I like that one too. I love the pink lemonade. Mm -hmm. Both of these flavors are really nice. They're very, very, very sweet. They have a grittiness um, the sugar, sugar on, the on the outside. And the texture is absolutely wonderful. Yeah. It's a non-sticky jelly bean. Kind I of. like the pink lemonade more than the watermelon. I do too. It's delicious. Yeah. Very, very sweet. The last one is cherry limeade. Wow. Mm, that's really good too. That is so awesome. Mm -hmm. That's the lime you want. Mm -hmm. Not the lime and those other things. No. No, that's a nice lime. And it mm -hmm. goes really well with that cherry. That's my favorite that, lime. That box, that bag is really good. That is totally worth a dollar. That is absolutely worth a dollar. I'd pay a dollar all day long for those. I like all three flavors. My favorite is the cherry limeade. Mine's the lime. Yeah, the cherry limeade. The, the, cherry, last the last one we had. That cherry limeade is a five out of five flavor. Yeah. It is wonderful. I think I might like the watermelon second. I thought I was going to like the pink lemonade second. I think I like the watermelon second. Well, I'm switching it. However, I would eat the whole bag. Like, I would like, too. like this is an excellent bag to buy. Normally, I don't necessarily feel that way about warheads because they are uncomfortably sour these are i i these I, are more sweet yes with a little tartness i don't know it. why they said uncomfortably sour i don't get much sourness from them at all it's mainly just a very very sweet pleasurable experience just like sour patch kids do you think they're going to be sour they're really not sour they're more sweet than anything that's what these are and it's a shame they put that on there because i think it'll keep some people buying them thinking they're going to be really sour and they're not you're missing out or it encourages some kids to buy it because they're wanting sour and right. they're going to be a little disappointed <laughs> i would totally get these all the time yeah that's I, nice. I, this is that's my favorite thing here yeah. but then i really do like the dolly mix i yeah. like the texture of the dolly mix it's not one i would have gonna go to all the time i wouldn't want to buy those all but the time. i would never get those randoms again no, yeah so if you've had if you're over in the uk or here and you've happened to have any of these you'll have to let us know your thoughts let us know which is your favorite and thanks for watching